Hello and welcome to JTV's Jewellery Care Repair Series. I'm John Brooks, one of the jewellers here at JTV. Our lesson today is how to fix a clasp on a tennis bracelet. Now this is probably one of the most common repairs we do in the shop and uh, it's a simple fix. Okay, so what's happened here with the bracelet, the male end or the tongue has become slack and it doesn't catch anymore in the clasp. You see, just like so. What's happened here is lost its memory. Now what is memory? Okay, I brought along a ruler here and it's normal state, it's completely flat. If I flex it and put a curve in it or a bend and then release it, it returns back to its natural state. That's its memory. And basically that's what's happened here with the bracelet. Over a period of time of you depressing this knob here for the catch, it has depressed it far enough where it won't catch under the lip here anymore and it just falls free. Now the easy way to repair that is with a pair of pliers. All we do here is get the end of your needle nose pliers under the tab and lift up very gently and just do a little bit at a time. You don't have to do too much. If you go too far, you can always press it back down again. But Okay, let's try that for size. Okay, now you can see that snap right back in there. Now another option is, if, if that's gonna to continue to be a problem over a period of time, you just pull that back out. The female end here, this little box area, you can get the same needle nose pliers and just gently squeeze down on them ever so slightly, just a little bit at a time. And that also will be a good fix for the same problem. Now another issue with the safety is the same thing, once again, the memory uh, is no good on that anymore and, and it just slips on and off. So what we just do here, with the needle nose pliers in the middle, there's a slight bend. We can just pinch down on that, squeeze it ever so slightly, and push that back on, and it snaps right back into place. Very easy. Thank you for watching our video today. Be sure to check out our channel for more great tips on jewelry care and repair. Come back and see us soon.